lo que ya sabía. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Good evening, Good evening teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome Good evening. to the English class. No, para nada. Le agarró la noche, dije. No, ¿saben, <ríe> ¿saben qué pasó? Eh, estaba buscando el archivo de la asistencia porque solamente había un, un docs, un, un solo de los, de los archivos que se abría. Si uno le da el link, solo aparecía la carpeta de alguien más, pero no aparecía el menú. De aparecen todas las clases para mm. ver la asistencia de ustedes estaba buscando y no la reporté y al fin ya la activaron entonces ya por esa okay. razón perdón perdón no 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 problema dicho pero ya está ya estamos aquí y es que como hay que hay que cenar a la carrera entre clase <risa> entre clase y clase de cada tengo una clase que termina a las siete y cuarenta y dos y a cenar y después la otra es... sí. o sea que en esta clase hace la digestión um, aquí toca <risa> aquí toca uh, hacer la okay. digestión ok let's share the, the screen Okay, so welcome everybody, <clears throat> or you are welcoming me because you were first. Okay, buenas noches, es el programa nacional de inglés para el trabajo, modalidad online, beginner to. Welcome to your English class. To today is Tuesday, December the 13th, and this is class 17, would like to. Would like to. Someone MJ says good evening. So I say good evening. Okay. This is the general objective. And this is the specific objective. And this is the class objective. Participants will be able to use would like to. Okay, and then the agenda. Availability. Teacher, availability, what's the meaning? Mm, there is no disponibility. In English, there is no disponibility. Availability is the word. Disponibilidad, availability. Right? Availability. Okay. Then desire and want, accepting and declining, would like and dialogue. Okay, let's go to the attendance. Camilo Ernesto Guzman. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Cecilia del Carmen Hernandez. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Fatima Lisette Janes. Excellent, nice, Fatima. Okay. Yeah, nice to hear you. Últimamente casi no la veo. <laughs> Solo la oigo así. Gerardo Alberto. Ah, lo siento, teacher, es que estoy viniendo muy tarde, pero hoy sí, ya, ya, ya estoy llegando. Ok. No problem. Gerardo is here, right? So, okay. Iliana Estela Serrano. Present teacher. Excellent, Gerardo. Hello, Hello present. Iliana Estela. Hello, Iliana. Okay, excellent. Isaías Santana. Present. Nice, very good. Javier Antonio Reyes. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Jessica Maricela Zabaleta. Present teacher. Very good, nice. José Eduardo Valdés. Ok. José Osmar Campos. Karen Leticia León. Carla Esterlina Guerra. Luis Alberto Cruz. 
Luis Enrique Castaneda. Present, Mr. Nice, very good. Manuel Antonio Romero. Present, teacher. Excellent, very good. Mirna Janet Saldaña. Present. Excellent. Noé Humberto Barrera. I'm here, Mr. Excellent, nice. Eh, Esaú Cartagena. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. And Ricardo Martinez. Okay. Present. Excellent, Ricardo. Let's see. Participants, I have like 17 people, but from 17, one, two, three, four, five, six people. Uh, it's like three people don't answer. Okay. I have one, two, three, four, five people that didn't answer. And uh, I have 17 people present, I means 16 people. Because this counts me too. Okay, let's continue. Availability, disponibilidad, right? So availability, disponibilidad. What's the meaning of availability? What's the meaning of disponib disponibilidad? If uh, the opening or the time to do something. Okay, example. Hey, can you come to my party tomorrow? Sorry, I can't. I have to work. The person is not available. Okay, and it says, hey, can you come to my party tomorrow night? Sure, no problem. I'll be there. The person is available. If you are available, you can do things, right? If you are not available, you are busy doing other things. Okay, so asking about availability. Are you free tonight? Do you have any plans for tonight? Do you have anything special for tonight? Are you doing anything special tonight? Are you busy tonight? Okay, so over here, let me see. I'm going to use this one. Yeah, it's okay. This one connects to this. This one connects to this. Okay. This one connects to this. This one connects to this. And this one connects to this. Something like that. So you say, are you free tonight? I am. Why? Okay. Are you free tonight? Not really. I have to work. Are you free tonight? Not really. I have to work. Do you have any plans for tonight? Actually, I do. What's the meaning? In reality, I do. Means I have plans. Or you say, no, not really. Why? The meaning is, no, I don't have plans. Why? Okay. Do you have anything special for tonight? Yes. Um, I'm having dinner with my friends. Okay. Or, no, not really. Why? Are you doing anything special tonight? I am. I am means I am busy. Okay. Or, are you doing anything special tonight? Not really. Do you have anything in mind? Do you have a... Do you have an invitation? Do you have plans for tonight? Are you busy tonight? No, not really. Why? Or actually, I am. I have to work. Okay, so that is asking about availability. Okay, 
we're going to pr practice asking for availability in this one. Do you have any plans for Monday evening? Yeah, okay, and in parentheses is yes. So you're going to use no and yes. Do you have any plans for Monday evening? Yes, I have to study for an exam. Or you say, actually I do. I have to study for an exam. Do you have any plans for Saturday night? No, not really. Why? So over here in parentheses, you have the answer. If it's yes or if it's no. Do you have any plans for Sunday afternoon? No, not really. Why? Do you have any plans for Wednesday morning? Actually, I do. I have to go to church. Okay. Do you have any plans for Thursday evening? No, not really. Why? Okay. So you can ask and answer this. We're going to go to the groups and we're going to practice this, the questions and the answers. Okay. Let me see. Four groups because we are 17, 16. Okay. The groups are open. Fatima, yes, excellent. Hola. 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 Se puede compartir. Deme unos minutos, voy a tratar de hacerlo yo. Bueno. Si es posible. Actually, I do, I have to, eso. Ajá, to oh, study okay. for an uh, exam. Ah, ok, 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 ok. Ajá. Pregunto yo o, y usted contesta. Ok. Vaya, eh, Carla, do you have any plans for Monday evening? Yes, actually I do. I have to study for an exam. Exam. Okay, uh, do you have any plans for Saturday night? No, not really, why? Okay, do you have any plans for Sunday afternoon? No, not really, why? 
Do you have any plans for uh, Sunday mon morning? Yes, actually I do. I have to go to church. Okay. Uh, do you have any plans for Friday night? No, not really. Why? Okay. Vaya, démosle chance a alguien más que practique. Hasta la próxima. Okay. Alguien que vaya conmigo. Ayo. Ayo. Va. Do you have any plan for Friday afternoon? Yes, actually I do. I have to study for exam. Do you have any plan for Wednesday night morning? No, not really. Why? Do you have any plan for Thursday afternoon? No, not really. Do you have any plan for Thursday evening? No, not really. Why? You do you have any plan for Tuesday morning? Yes, I do. I have a, I have to help my father why something. Va, dale, si querés pregunta vos, yo te contesto. Okay. Do you have on Friday? Eh, ya no me acuerdo. Friday, eh, Number eight. Wednesday morning. Wednesday morning. Wednesday morning. Yes, actually, I have to to go to graduation. Okay, hey, Luis, do you have any plans for? Tuesday evening? Uh, no, not really. Why? Ahora, ¿quién va? Voy a, voy a preguntar yo. Uh, empecemos por Jessica. Jessica, do you have any plans for Sunday morning? Actually, I do. I have got to share. Uh, Manuel, do you have any plans for Tuesday morning? Yes, actually I do. I have to help my father what sometime. sometime. Uh, Esau, do you have any plans for uh, Wednesday morning? Yes, actually I do have to go to a graduation. Okay, Jessica, uh, do you have any plan for a Sunday morning? No, excuse me. Do you have uh, Do you have any plan for Sunday afternoon? Afternoon. No, not really. Why? Okay, Manuel, um, do you have Do you have any plan for Friday afternoon? No, not really. Why? Esau, uh, uh, do you have any plan for Tuesday afternoon? <clears throat> yes. At quality, I do go to university. I have to go to university. Okay, next. Okay, Manuel, Jessica, bye. do you have, <laughs> do you have any plan for Saturday night? Saturday night. Saturday. Uh, no, not really. Why? Manuel, do you have plan for Friday night? No, not really. Why? 
Do you, do you have any plan for Tuesday afternoon? Uh, actually, I do. I have to go to university. Jessica, do you have any plan for Saturday morning? Uh, actually, I do. I have. No, not really. White? Do you have uh, any plan? Any plans for Sunday afternoon? No, not really. Why? Do you have any plan for Sunday morning? Uh, Actually, I do. I have to go to uh, to church. Do you have any plan for Friday night? No, not really. Wait. Do you have any plan for Monday morning? Actually, I do. I have to go to the court. Friday. Este, este, teacher. Teacher, ahí está, ¿verdad? Ajá. Sí. Este, solo tengo una duda con esa, este, con la B, en la respuesta, ¿verdad? Diga. Eh, en la respuesta uno siempre pregunta por qué. Ajá. Al final, ¿verdad? Sí. Es Solamente una parte de, de un diálogo. Vaya. Lo, lo que está haciendo, el propósito de esto es abrir la oportunidad de invitar a alguien. Entonces, lo que usted quiere es de invitar a la persona y no, per, no perder el tiempo invitando a una persona ocupada, es preguntarle si va a tener tiempo. ¿Verdad? Hey, are you, por ejemplo, así le dice. Do you have any plans for Saturday night? And the person says, no, not really. Why? Would you like to go to my party on Saturday night? Okay, you have the invitation. But if the person says, um, like Sunday morning, do you have any plans for Sunday morning? Actually, I do. I have to go to church. Okay, no hay invitación. Right? Why? The person is busy. Okay. See the point. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Aquí le pregunta, le dice, ah, estoy libre. ¿Por qué? Porque te quiero invitar a que vamos o que vayamos. Okay? Mm -hmm. That's the reason why. Not really. Why? Entonces en esa ya en la segunda respuesta, digamos, siempre tiene que ir. I do y I have to. Eh, Actually, I do, I have to. Tiene que, por eso les le pongo aquí en, después de yes, les pongo la actividad para que ustedes digan, actually, I do. Por ejemplo, en la número uno, actually, I do. I have to study for an exam. Y number four, actually, I do. I have to go to church. Y number six, actually, I do. I have to go to work. Actually, uh -huh. I do. I have to go to a graduation. Nine. Actually, I do. I have to go shopping with my mom. Actually, I do. I have to go to the university. Etc. Does that answer your question, my friend? Contesta su pregunta? Sí, sí. Sí, ahí es. 
Ah, es que sí estaba ahí, con duda. Prácticamente, ¿en qué momento has podido utilizar las la respuestas esas? Man? Ok, no problem. Ok. Entonces, continue. Okay, my dear Angelitos, let's continue. We have pre-task. With a pre-task, we say desire and want. Which are desire and want? Yeah. Eh, want se puede traducir como carencia. Usted no tiene y usted quiere. <laughs> okay, carencia. Desire, aunque tenga, quiere. <laughs> okay, so. Es different, ok. Um, pero en la gramática vamos a usar así. Desire would like to. Want, want. Examples. Eh, I want to buy a house. I want to travel abroad. I want to find a job. She wants to see you. She wants to to meet you, okay, want, desire, I'd like to go out tonight, I'd like to eat something salty, I'd like to travel to New York next month, she'd like to get a job with us, she'd like to have a family someday, desire, want, want, desire, okay. Um, me van a preguntar, teacher, pero want and would like no significan lo mismo. Um, no sé si ustedes se han fijado cuando le dicen me gustaría, o sea que ya no le gusta. Pero es una forma amable de hablar. Um, yo les diría, expresamos nuestros deseos y, nos, y lo que queremos usando estos medios, pero... Cuando viajemos, tengamos cuidado de cómo lo usamos. No usemos want cuando vayamos a una tienda, por ejemplo. I want this, I want that, I want that. Es rudo. O sea, no, no rudo, no. Es descortés. ¿Verdad? It's rude. It's rude to use it that way. Quiero eso, quiero aquello. No. Podría darme, may I have, or I'd like, could I have, ya lo practicamos, ¿verdad? could I have, o no lo hemos practicado todavía, o eso viene. Bueno, no me acuerdo si ya lo practicamos o no, pero si no, ya, ya lo vamos a practicar. Ok, could I have, no, ese es mañana o pasado, could I have, I'd like to have, eso es amable. I want, con sus amigos sí, díganles, I want to buy a house. It's okay. But if you go to a store, don't say, I want two chocolates. It's, it's rude. You can say. Teacher, I have a, a, a question. I have a question. Yes. Um, I is uh, uh, esa es la contracción de qué, teacher? Would the would. Es la contracción de would. Okay. Es la contracción de este, ¿verdad? The would. Ah, oh, excelente. Por eso es que, ¿Se acuerdan que el tema de la, de la lección de hoy es would like? Estaba la forma completa. 
would. Y would es una forma amable. Es la forma amable. Decimos, good afternoon. I would like, um, I would like to buy a, but some people say, ah, you would, but you won't. Nah. Because they like to joke, right? Ah, you would, but you won't. So it's better if you say, good evening, may I have? Si van a pedir algo, pueden usar, may I have? May I have, or could I have? Could I have, may I have, may I have, could I have? So you can use either of these. Could I have, may I have, para pedir cosas que ustedes quieran comprar. Y, son, y es amable. Okay. Having said this, desire, desire and want. Let's practice. I want to because I'd like to. Okay, we're going to practice saying this. I want to start saving money because I'd like to buy a house. I want to get the visa because I'd like to travel to the USA. I want to buy the newspaper because I'd like to look for a job. I want to find a girlfriend because I'd like to get married. Quiero porque me gustaría. Me gustaría casarme. Okay. I'd like to get married. Right? This is more like polite. I want to start saving money because I'd like to buy a house. I want to get married. Because I'd like to have a family of my own. I want to call Maria because I'd like to ask her out. Right? So start saving money. Buy a house. Get the visa. Travel to the USA. Buy the newspaper. Look for a job. Find a girlfriend. Get married. Get married, have a family of my own. Call Maria, ask her out. Visit the zoo, see the elephant. Visit the mechanic, ask him to fix my car. Go to the supermarket, buy some milk. Get the book, study the lesson. Study the lesson, learn English. Talk with the teacher. Ask him something. Go to a quiet place. Relax for a while. Relax for a while. Okay. Questions? Solamente si me puedes repetir una vez más las dos. Eh, lo que estaba digitando usted en la lámina anterior. Del may y del. May Ajá, I ese. May I have, could I have? Ajá, de que uno para pedir las cosas es un poco cortés, creo que es el may I have. Las dos formas. Ah, las dos formas. Ok. Ya. Yeah. Okay, gracias. Ok, no problem. Y en un restaurante dice I'll have. Para ah. ordenar la comida dice I'll have. They ask you, excuse me, sir. Are you ready to order? And you say, yes, I'll have the chicken. I'll have, uh, I'll have the chicken. Expresa seguridad, okay? I'll have the chicken. It's a decision at the moment of speaking besides. Okay, so let's, let's do this one. Let's go. Teacher, 
el, 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 el I'll es, es la contracción de I, I, I y will. will. I will. Ah, ok. Gracias. I, I will. Yes. Ok, let's go to the group. Let's practice this. Mm -hmm. The groups are opening. Jessica. Y se ella está por ahí. En sí. En esa igual practicar sería. Sí, practicar. I want to start saving money because I like to. Y allí voy a responder yo qué sería. Me imagino que sería ahí este ah no no perdón una sola oración era ajá es que una sola oración usted dice igual tú estar saving money Because I'd like to buy a house. A house, ajá. Entonces, quizás la mitad y la mitad practiquemos. Digo hasta las diez, hasta las seis y luego usted hasta la que continúa. Bye. I want to get the visa because I like to travel to the USA. I want to buy the newspaper because I like to look for a home. I want to think for a job. I want to look for a job. 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 Sí, job. Como que de la Biblia va. <laughs> sí, y también se llama job. <laughs> El libro más nuevo. Uh -huh. Gracias. Okay. I want to Find a girlfriend because I like to get married. I want to get married because, because I like to have a family of my own. I want to call Maria because I like to ask her Out. 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 Gracias. Ahí está ahí es. I want to visit this so because I like to do. Gracias. Because I like to study The, the lesson. Uh, I want to study the lesson because I like to learn English. Uh, I want to take with the teacher because I like to uh, ask him sometime. 
Ok, ¿quién continúa? Next. Ya ni iba yo, ¿verdad? ¿Y Aníbal entonces? ¿Yo? Sí, Gerardo. Ok, ¿y en qué número se quedó? En el 12. Ok. I want to talk why the teacher. Because I like to ask. Talk with the teacher. Talk with the teacher. I like to. I want to go to a key place. Because I like to relax for an outright. To fix my car. I want, I want to go, go to the supermarket because I like to buy some milk. I want to get the book. Because I like to study the lesson. I want to study the lesson because I like to learn English. I want to I want to talk with the teacher because I like to ask him something. Uh, talk I want talk with the teacher. Talk 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 talk. Talk with the teacher. Talk with the teacher. Talk. Así va. Talk. Yeah. Talk with the teacher. I'd like to ask him something. Mm -hmm. Okay. I want. I want to talk with the teacher because I like to ask him something. Something. Yes. I want to go to a quiet place. Place. Because. Because. I like to relax for a palar al way. I will. A while for a while. I will. For, for a while. while. For a while. Next. Perdón, perdón, pensé que te había apagado el, el micrófono. Seguí, Ricardo. ¿Qué le pasó? No se le escuchaba. No, no, por eso te digo, pensé que tenía apagado el micrófono, pero seguí vos. No, hombre, dele con todo, no hay problema. Vale, dele. Continue, continue. Dele, no es. Estamos aprendiendo. Ya lo dijo. Ah, ya lo dijo, ok. Sí. I want to start saving money because I because like saving money, saving start. hey Saving money. Saving money. I want to start saving money because I'd like to buy a house. I want to get the visa because I'd like to travel to the USA. The USA. Uh -huh. I want to buy the newspaper. Because I would delight to look for a job. I want to find a girl girlfriend because I do like to get mar married. I want to get married because I would delight to have a family of my own. I want to call Mary because I would delight to ask her out. Ask her I out. want ask her? Ask her out. Ask, ask her. Ask her out. Ask ask her out. Mm -hmm. Ask her out. Mm -hmm. Ask her out. Okay. Because I would the light to ask her out. I want to visit the soul because I would the light to see the elephant. I want to visit the mechanics because I would like to see, uh, pardon, uh, because I would like to ask him, ask him to fix my car. I want to go to the supermarket because I would like to buy some milk. 
Eyes like what? Eyes like light. Eyes light. Eyes light. Yes, uh, echo. Very good. Yes. Because eyes light to eyes, eyes light. Eyes light. Eyes light. Light. Mm -hmm. Because eyes light, light to buy some milk. Excellent. I want to get the books because I like to study the lesson. I want to study, uh, I want to talk with the teacher because I like... Talk with the teacher. Talk. Talk with the teacher. Talk, talk with the teacher. I want to the talk with the teacher. I want to talk. I want to talk. I want to talk. I want to talk with the teacher because I'll delight to I, asking. I like. I like mm -hmm. to asking him something. To ask him something. Something. To ask him something. To asking, to asking something. Yes. I want to go to um kids' place quiet, because quiet place. Quiet place. Quiet place. Okay. I want to go to a quiet place because I like to relax for and and for a while. I will. For a while. I'll for a while. For a while. For a while. Excellent. Thank you. Yes, you were. Excellent. Hola. Hola. Perdón, perdón. Hola. <ríe> perdón, me equivoqué. No ok, ladies and gentlemen, eh, let's continue. Task preparation, accepting and declining. Accepting and declining. What's the meaning? Accepting. Yes. Declining, mm, no. Okay. And the purpose is to accept and decline invitations. Invitations. What's an invitation? You say, hey, would you like to drink some coffee with me tonight? Sorry, I can't. My wife is jealous. Uh, she doesn't have to know. <laughs> Forget it. Eye in the sky, looking at you. <laughs> you remember the song, right? So, eye in the sky, looking at you. All right. So, you say, would you like, that's an invitation. Would you like some coffee? And you accept. Yes, please. Coffee will be fine. Sure. Why not? Thanks. Or, of course, thanks. Or without sugar, please, okay? Or you say, yes, thank you. Would you like some coffee without sugar, please, okay? Would you like some coffee? Yes, thank you. Would you like some coffee? Sure, why not? Would you like uh, some coffee? Yes, please, coffee would be fine, okay? Or you decline, you say, no, thanks, all right? Okay, you decline. Would you like? Would you like uh, some coffee? No, thanks. I'm fine. Would you like uh, some coffee? Thanks, but I don't drink coffee. Would you like some coffee? Not for me, thanks. Not for me, thanks. Would you like some coffee? That's very kind of you, but I don't drink coffee. That's very kind of you. That's very nice of you, but I don't drink coffee. Okay, so something like that. Accepting, 
decline. Okay. I repeat. Would you like some coffee? Yes, please. Coffee will be fine. Sure. Why not? Thanks. Of course. Thanks. Without sugar, please. Yes, thank you. Or you decline. No, thanks. I'm fine. No, thanks. Right? Or you say, thanks, but I don't drink coffee. Not for me, thanks. That's very kind of you, but I don't drink coffee. So, declining. Decline is not accept. So you're not accepting anything, so you're declining. Okay, let's go to the attendance, and then we will practice. Well, we will read this before we go to the attendance. Would you like to go for a walk this afternoon? Sorry, I can't. I'm busy this afternoon. Would you like to have lunch with me this afternoon? Sorry, I can't. I have to work this afternoon. Would you like to go shopping with me this afternoon? Sorry, I can't. I don't have any money. Would you like to go jogging with me tomorrow morning? Sorry, I can't. I don't have any time. I have to go to work. Would you like to play a table game with me tomorrow afternoon? Sure. Why not? I'm not doing anything there. Okay, volunteers to read the questions. Okay, I meet two people. I say volunteers, one person, one person, one person, the question and the other, the answer. Okay, so, Luis Enrique, Manuelito, the answer, okay. Okay. Uh, would you like to go for a walk this afternoon? I'm so, sorry. I can't. I'm busy this afternoon. Would you like to have lunch with me this afternoon? Sorry. I can't. I have to work this afternoon. Would you like to go shopping with me this afternoon? Sorry, I can't. I don't have any money. Would you like to go jogging with me tomorrow morning? Sorry, I can't. I don't have any time. I have to go to work. Would you like to play a table game with me tomorrow afternoon? Sure, why not? I'm not doing anything thing. Okay. Uh, let's see. Now the, the, there were two ladies who wanted to practice. Okay. Me? Yes. Okay. Mirna makes the questions. Hi. Okay, Ricardo, you answer them. Excellent. Would you like to go for a walk this afternoon? Walk, walk, for a walk. So, sorry, I can, I bus, I bus, busy yeah, this work. afternoon. Busy. 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 Work. Como bicicleta, busy. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I can, I busy this afternoon. Okay. Would you like to have lunch with me this afternoon? Sorry, I can. I have to work this afternoon. This afternoon? Afternoon. This afternoon. Sorry, I can. I have to work this afternoon. Would you like to go shopping? with me this afternoon sorry i can i don't have any money would you like 
to go jogging with me tomorrow morning. Sorry, I can't. I don't have any time. I have to work. I I have to to go to work. Would you like to play a table game with me tomorrow afternoon? Sure. With not. I am not doing anything then. Okay. Thank you. Table, table game. And why table not? game. Table game. Uh -huh. And why table. not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Okay. Why not? Excellent. Very good. Um, I had uh, Ceci's Manita up. And uh, so Ceci is asking the questions. And another volunteer is answering. Me, teacher. Yes, Javier. Okay, go ahead. Ceci okay. asks the questions and Javier answers them. Okay. Uh, go, you like to go for a uh, while this afternoon? Javier. Sorry, I can I visit this afternoon. Uh, go, you like to have lunch with me this afternoon? Sorry, I can I have to work this afternoon. Go, you like to go shopping with me this afternoon? Would you like? Sorry, I can I don't have any money. Go, you like to go jogging with me tomorrow morning? Sorry, I can't. I don't have any time. I have to go to work. Okay. Go, you like to play a table game uh, with me tomorrow afternoon? Sure. Why not? I'm not doing anything then. Excellent. Very good. Only would, would. Would you like? Would you like? Would you like? Would you like? Would, would you like? Would. Imagine would. you have your boyfriend in front. Would, would you like? Would you like? Would you like? Would, <laughs> would you like? Uh -huh. Would you like? Yes. Would you like? So, puede decir would you, would you like, or would you like, como con R. Las dos formas está bien. Okay. So, thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Attendance, right? Let's go to attendance. When we come back, we're going to practice. But we're going to practice this with wood. Okay. So, let's go to the attendance. Camilo Ernesto Guzman. Present, Mr. Excellent, nice. Cecilia del Carmen Hernández. Present. Excellent, nice. Fátima Lisset Llanes. Present. Excellent, nice. Gerardo Alfredo Chicas. Ileana Estela Serrano. Present. Excellent, Isaías Santana González. Present, teacher. Excellent. Nice. Javier Antonio Reyes. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Jessica Maricela Zabaleta. Jessica no está, ¿verdad? Okay. All right. José Eduardo Valdés. Present. Excellent. Nice. José Osmar Campos. Present teacher. Excellent. Nice. Karen Leticia León. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Carla Esterlina Guerra. Present. Ah, you are present, Carlita. Okay. All right. Yes. Luis Alberto Cruz. Present. Excellent, nice. Very good. Okay. Oh. Present, Mr. <laughs> okay. 
13 pupusas, wow, thirteen pupusas. <laughs> okay, so let's continue. We're going to do the task. Okay, what Mi are we present. going to do? Sorry? Attended. <laughs> we finished the attendance, Gerard, uh, Ricardo. No, 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 no. Yo soy casi el último y me quedé esperando ahí el 10. No, no lo mencionó, teacher. teacher. Eso, salga a la Luis? defensa. No lo no, Luis también, no. no que me, me... Se, se quedó hablando de pupusa. No, Luis. Hasta Luis Enrique, ¿verdad? Sí. Yeah. La culpa la tiene Luis. No, a mí no me mencionó por eso. La, la, la comida. Mencionó las pupusas, las 13 pupusas. Las prioridades del teacher, ya vieron. Luis Enrique Castaneda. Ok, Manuel, Manuel Antonio Romero. Present teacher. Excelente. Mirna Janet Saldaña. Present teacher. Excelente. Noé Humberto Barrera. Present teacher. Excelente. Esaú Cartagena. Present, teacher. Excellent. And Ricardo Martinez. Okay. Present. Yes. Teacher, I have another question. Ask. What is the difference? Different. No, ¿cuál es la diferencia entre would you y could you? Okay. Es más de would you es te gustaría, quisieras. Y el otro es podrías. Ah, ok. Could you, podrías. Eh, quiero que me ayuden. Eh, no es una invitación, sino que es que hagan algo por mí. Yo prefiero decir. Could, hey, could you buy me some milk? Could you buy me some milk? Pero, si es una invitación, es preferible decir. Would you like. Right? Sí, sí. Claro. O también si es un offering, si le ofrecemos algo. Would you like a sandwich? Would you like a sandwich? No, could you a sandwich, right? Would you like a sandwich? ¿Querrías, te gustaría comer tu sandwich? Would you like a sandwich? Y dice, yes, please. Okay. Esa sería la diferencia. Y should, teacher. Eh, algún día vamos a estudiar should, Carlita. Hoy no lo vamos okay. a estudiar. No vamos a, a practicar should, pero le voy a contestar así rapidito. Should es para, significa, bueno, significa es una buena idea. Okay. We should go now. Es una buena idea que nos vayamos ahorita. Entonces lo decimos, deberíamos irnos ahorita. We vamos. should, okay. we should Go. Llegamos a esa idea, vámonos ya. Ey, de verdad, sí. <risa> so, so, should, should. We should. Los tres son auxiliares, ¿verdad? Sí, son tres, tres auxiliares bien bonitos. Should. ¿Cómo se escribe ese último? Should, así como se oye. Es. No. Should. Oh. Y el otro es could. Y el otro es would. You can teacher before in, informal. Sí, informal. can es para requests y lo vamos a estudiar mañana, creo, pasado okay. mañana. Y es okay. son para peticiones, o sea, requests. Mm -hmm. so okay. Should, would, and could. Would. Mm. Yeah, of course. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. So, what do we have to do? Match. Match. Okay, match. And because they are together, we're going now. Nah, first, this. Okay. Uno por uno. Hagamos este primero. Let's do this one and then we go to this. Okay. Let's go to the groups and practice. What do you have to do? Match. Okay. But check, check the vocabulary. It's very cold. It's very hot. I'm very hungry. Hungry. I'm very. Hungry, not angry. Angry is the teacher is angry, right? So, but no, hungry. 
hungry. I could I can eat three pizzas. Okay, so yeah. I'm hungry, very hungry. So hungry. I'm very sleepy. Sleepy. Teacher, sleepy. Estoy cayendo del sueño, right? I'm sleepy. I'm sleepy. Okay. Tengo sueño. I'm sleepy. So I'm very busy. I'm very busy now. Busy. I'm very busy now. I'm very lonely now. Lonely. Teacher, lonely, solitario. Teacher, solo y solitario son diferentes. Sí. Solo es cuando usted físicamente está aislado de los demás. O sea, no hay nadie con usted. Solitario es cuando hay un montón de gente con usted, pero usted eso no le llena. Necesita gente específica. Su familia o sus amigos. Se siente solitario. Okay. Long. Angry. Okay. I'm very angry. I'm very sad. Very sad. Nobody loves me. Right? Bien triste. I'm very thirsty. Thirsty. Sediento. Thirsty. I'm very tired. Tired is you want to drink water. I'm very tired. Serien, no, tired. I'm very thirsty. Want to drink water. Tired. Cansado. Okay. Then the activities. I'd like to go for a swim. Este I'd like es me gustaría, right? I'd like to go for a swim. I'd like to drink something cold. I'd like to drink something cold. I'd like to take a nap. I'd like to eat a sandwich. I'd like my faith. No, I'd like my family to be here. I'd like someone to help me. I'd like someone to hug me. Hug me. I'd like someone to hug me. I'd like to be alone. I'd like to be alone. I'd like to rest for a while. I'd like to rest for a while. Rest and descansar. Rest. I'd like to rest for a while. I'd like to drink something. I'd like to drink something. Me gustaría tomar algo. So you say, I'd like to drink something. Okay. Questions? Angelitos, questions? No. Let's go to the groups and match. Work together, match. Then we come back. Okay. Here we go. Jessica, Isaías, San Gerardo are not in the group. Va a iniciar, Fátima. A iniciar el qué? O sea, vamos a unir. Entendí que íbamos a unir las de la izquierda con la derecha. Ah, es que me había equivocado entonces. Right, 
I eat something healthy. It's very hot. Quiero ver si es por solo la tres que podamos unir con la D. I'm very hungry. Con la D, it's very cold. Creo que sería con la uno, puede ser con la J. Ah, no, perdón, la dos con la J. J que dice drink something. It's very hot. Ah, oh, sí, puede ser. I very sleep. Yes. Okay, now we start. So tired. La 4 con la I. La 10 con la C. Sí. No sé. La 4 con la I me dijo. Mm, dije, creo que sí. Sí, la 4 con la I. Eh, la cuatro con la C ya está. Sí. Eh, con la no, no está. No está la cuatro. La cuatro es... Ah, I'm perdón, sí, la cuatro con la I la unimos. ¿Con ahí? Sí. Y la diez con la... Que es lonely Solitario Solitario Solitario, solito Solitario, solitario. Okay. <laughs> I am very hungry uh, Este no uh, I like to be alone <laughs> Okay. Eh, I, uh, I am very sad, sad. Está triste. No, sí, ¿verdad? Sad es triste. Sí. No. Yes. Para que no esté triste. Oh. <laughs> Hace falta. Mm. I like to drink something. <laughs> <laughs> Eso le iba a decir yo, pero no lo dije. No, ahí sí. <laughs> Vaya, esa Carlita. No. <laughs> Porque qué significa la I like to rest for a while? A while? Uh, I like to rest, descansar un rato. Sería con I'm very tired. I'm very tired, ok. Entonces nos queda la 8 y la 9. Es I'm very sad y I'm very thirsty. Estoy muy triste. Entonces, una está triste y la otra está sediento y las dos dicen I like to drink something. <risa> Ajá. Por estar triste y sediento cualquiera de las dos. Ay, la Dios nueve Dios. no es la J. La nueve es la J. I'm very thirsty. Tengo mucha sed y me gustaría beber algo. Vamos, joven. 
Por eso, o sea, ahí es donde teníamos la otra opción, fíjate, porque la última es que dice, I like es que to eso? drink something, quisiera tomar algo ahora. No, porque ah, pero, tomar pero algo. Very hot, tendría que ser letter J. No, hombre, la, la uno puede ser con la, el, con la B, puede ser, la primera dice. Eh, es que eh, la uno dice, está muy helado. Ah, sí, no puede ser esa, ¿no? porque me gustaría ver algo frío más helado. No, yo hablo de la, de la ¿El letra del número dos. Mm -hmm. Ahí pudiera ser. No, pero Por eso, pero si le pones ese diente, no le vas a poner, voy a ir a nadar. No, con la J, pues. J. Ah, con la última. Dos con la J. Pero la igual, o sea, no. Me gustaría beber algo, dice, pues si está cal no, caluroso. Es que, es que si está que sediento. No sería, la nueve sería con la J. Tengo mu yo. La nueve, tengo mucha sed, dice. Ajá. Ah, también puede ser. Algo. Oye, el otro que está very hot es el que, que quisiera tomar algo también frío. ¿no? Ajá. Pero ahí es donde pusimos nosotros ir a nadar. A ver, eh, pero sobraría. Que me gustaría ir a nadar para ponerle en la 1. Está muy helado e ir a nadar no tiene sentido. Va, entonces tenemos. Esta es la 10. Pero es que el otro, ¿Tú? el hay. I like to rest for a while, ¿qué es? Eso quiere decir guay. Un descanso. Eh, me gustaría descansar un rato. Ah, ah pues, el number 10. Uh -huh. eh, Ajá. Es ¿no? Vale, entonces, ¿cuál nos queda? La... Solo la 1 con la letter B. Que no o sea, que está de lado, quiere ir a tomar algo de lado. Ajá, no tiene sentido. Uh -huh. No, es que nos equivocamos en una. Ah, pues otra sí. que nos hemos ahí intercambiado. Teacher, nos sobra la letter B. <ríe> Hace mucho frío. Me gustaría ir a nadar, me gustaría ver algo frío, me gustaría tomar una fiesta, me gustaría que me... Ah, la familia aquí, necesito ayuda, necesito cuando, un abrazo, hace calor, necesito estar uno, solo. Se compra algo heladito, se lo algo toma. Heladito, ajá. Yo también puedo ir a nadar si tuviera una piscina. Que no voy a ir. Cuando hablamos, pero no... Cambiemos de ahí. Cambiémosle col y pongámosle hot. No, pero ya está ahí. ¿verdad? No, no. Very hot. I like to drink something cold. Es como correo electrónico. Aquí va y le ponemos. Ay, que el... ah, bueno, no sé. Ay, Por eso es que si le ponemos, vaya, I'm very hot. Y le ponemos que necesita algo helado. Let's see if we match. Yes, the, the original. Okay, it's very cold. I'd like to drink something hot. It's very hot. I'd like to go for a nosotros nos aparecía something cold. Porque ya se trampa. Me imaginé, nos puso una cajerita. Sí, porque es la que nos sobraba y le parecía cool. O sea, helado con helado. Ya le hice trampa, por eso. I'm very hungry. What do you say? I like to eat. I like to eat. A sandwich. A sandwich. I'm very sleepy. Let her see. I like to, I like take, to a take a nap. Take a nap. I'm very busy now. I like some some help me to help me. I'm very uh -huh. lonely. I like 
my family to be here. I like my family to be here. I'm very angry. Angry. I mm -hmm. like to be alone. To be alone. Mm -hmm. I'm very sad. I'm sad. I love I some to some, help me. Someone to help me. Yes. I'm very thirsty. I like to drink something. I like to drink something. I'm very tired. I like to read for a lot. I like to read for a while. Hoy oh, sí, verdad. Ah, pues aquí era el cold. Sí, ahí estábamos confundidos porque no le vamos a poner helado con helado. Ajá, cabal. Este helado sí. necesita algo helado. <laughs> helado. Ok, that's right. Ok, excelente. Good job. Now let's continue. We have the other one. Offering. Offering. Uh, one person says, I'm very cold. Uh, something like hot. Something hot. Would you like something hot? Yes, please. Yes, please. Or no, thank you. Yes, please. Or no, thank you. Okay. I'm very hot. Uh, would you like to go for a swim? Uh, and then the answer here is no. No, thank you. I'm very hungry. And the answer is yes. We say, would you like uh, something to eat? Yes, please. The other is no, four. I'm very sleepy. Would you like to take a nap? No, thank you. Okay, I'm very busy now. Would you like uh, some help? Yes, please. Okay, practice, practice with your partner. Aquí le dan la respuesta. Yes, yes, please. No, no, thank you. Okay. So this, let's go back to the groups and practice. It's the same pronunciation, pero tiene dos más. No. Sí, dos más. Tiene, I'm very confused. I'm very, I'm afraid. I'm afraid. I'm com very confused. I'm very worried about my mom. I'm very worried about my mom. Worried, preocupado, right? Afraid. I'm afraid. Tengo miedo. I'm afraid. I'm afraid. I'm very confused. Estoy bien confundido. I'm very confused. I'm very nervous. Estoy bien nervioso. I'm very nervous. Okay. So, and the other ones? Would you like a hug? Okay, would you like something hot? Would you like to go for a swim? Would you like? Uh-huh. Okay. Mm, if here it says go for a swim. Le, le van a tener que poner el to. Would you like to go for a swim? Porque el to se quedó. Se quedó dormido. Okay. Would you like to go for a swim? Would you like something to eat? Would you like to take a nap? Would you like some help? Would you like some company? Would you like to be left alone? Would you like a hug? Would you like something to drink? Would you like to rest for a while? Would you like me to explain that to you? Would you like to would you like me to walk you home? ¿Quieres que te encamine a casa? Would you like me to walk you home? Eh, would you like me to take her to the hospital? Would you like me to take her to the hospital? Would you like me to help you with something? Okay, yes, please, no, thank you. Okay, let's go and practice. Okay, let's say groups are open. Please join.
Ajá, o por decir la segunda, usted dice, I'm very hot. Ajá. Y, oh, do ¿Y you la like? Oh, uh, no, de ahí dice, oh, do you like? Es como una pregunta, oh, do you like? Who for as we? Would you like? Would you like? Would you like? Would you like? Go for a swing. Would you like something hot? I'm very hungry. I'm very, I'm very hungry. Would you like something? I'm very as something hot, something hot, something to have. Yes, please. I am very busy now. Uh, will you like sometime to eat? Yes, please. Okay, I very lonely. Would you like sometime, sometime, some company? No, thank you. I am very angry. Would you like? Would you like to be live alone? Yes, please. I am very sad. Uh, would you like uh would you like to uh, to a uh, call? No, thank you. Next uh bueno, voy a hacer otra. Lo yo. Ajá, correcto. I am very thirsty. Would you like some time to drink? Yes, please. Okay. I am very tired. Would you like some? Would you like to rest for and wine? No, thank you. I am very confused. Would you like me to explain take to you? Yes, please. I am fried. Would you like me to take you home? No, thank you. I am very worried about my mom. Would you like me to take your toe? Worry, 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 worry. Very worried about my mom. I am, I am very worried about my mom. Yes, please. Okay, I'm very nervous. Uh, would you like some company? No, thank you. Ah. Okay, entonces tenemos a Javier, Manuel y Esaú. Eh, Javier, yes. eh, I'm very tired. Uh, would you like to rest for a while? <laughs> no, thank you. Eh, Manuel, eh, uh, I am very worried about my mom. Would you like me to take her to the hospital? Yes, please. Yes, so I'm uh, very nervous. 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 Would you like me to tell you with something? 
Uh, no, thank you. Help you with something? Help you with something. You with Need to something. help you with something? But, um, uh, Javier, um, I'm very busy now. What? Repeat, please. I very busy now. Busy now. Busy oh, now. Busy. I'm sorry. I'm would, sorry. Would you like to some help? Uh, yes, please. Uh, Manuel, uh, <laughs> I'm very hot. Would you like to go for a swing? Lips, lips. Would you like to... Ah, uh, that teacher, <laughs> Malia Luiba. <laughs> Excuse me, teacher. Um, is the intonation? <laughs> the <same> movie. <laughs> uh, would you like go for a swim? Is the answer? Uh, okay, continue, uh, Manuel. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, Manuel, eh, ay, no. Okay, now we're going to be practicing invitations, okay? We're going to be inviting our partners. Practice inviting a partner. Would you like to go to the movies with me next Saturday? Sorry, I'm busy on Saturday. I have to study for an exam. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time, okay? So in these ones, all say, sorry, I'm very busy, okay? And the, and the date, right? Um, would you like to go for a walk next Saturday afternoon? And you say, sorry, I'm busy on Saturday afternoon. I have to go shopping with my mom. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time, okay? You say, uh, would you like to go for a pizza next Tuesday or just for pizza? Would you like to go for pizza next Tuesday? And you say, sorry, I'm busy next, I'm, I'm busy that day or I'm busy next Tuesday. I have to work that day. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, no problem. Okay, substitute the time expression. Next Saturday, right? I'm busy on Saturday. Next Sunday morning, I'm busy Sunday morning. I have to go to church. So you have go for a walk next Saturday afternoon. Go shopping with my mom. Go for a boat ride next Sunday morning. Go to church. Play basketball with me tomorrow afternoon. Work. Eat out next Saturday. Do the laundry. Go dancing with me next week. Prepare for final exams. Watch a series on Netflix with me tonight. Do homework. Go for a swim tomorrow morning. Go to university. Go for a pizza next Tuesday. Work that day. Go for an ice cream this afternoon. Take care of my mom. Go jogging with me tomorrow morning. Go to work early. Okay. Let's practice. So, hello. Remember the time expression. Would you like to... Let me see.
here. This is repeated. This is repeated. I'm busy on, and you say the time. And I have to. And then also this repeated all the time. Okay, so you say, would you like to go for a walk next Saturday afternoon? Sorry, I'm busy on Saturday afternoon. I have to go shopping with my mom. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time. And practice with all of them. Okay, let's go to the groups and let's practice. Groups are opening, please jump. Mirna, hola, 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 este, Ajá. comenzamos, sí, inicia, no sé qué vamos a hacer porque me levanté, <risa> Practice the conversation. Practice the conversation. Substitute this here. Would you like to go for a walk next Saturday afternoon? Sorry, I'm busy on Saturday, Saturday afternoon. I have I have to go shopping with my mom. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure. Some other time. Would okay. You like to go for a swim tomorrow morning. Sorry, I'm busy tomorrow morning. I have, I have to go to university. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure. Some other time. Okay. Good you do good you like to go for a walk next Saturday afternoon? Sorry, I'm I'm boss. I'm boss. Busy. I'm busy. I'm busy. I'm sorry. I have to study for an exam. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time. Um. Would you like to go for a walk right next Sunday morning? Sorry, I am busy on Sunday. I have to walk to shore. Okay. Um, Jose Eduardo está. Yes. Okay, maybe some other time. Would, would you like to play basketball with me tomorrow afternoon? Afternoon? Tendría que contestar con el literal de este. 
Okay, sorry, I am busy on Saturday. I have to work. Okay, maybe some other time. Um, Isaias, would you like to eat out next Saturday? Sorry, I am busy on duty laundry. Okay, maybe some other time. Luis eh, Alberto, could you what? Could uh, you like to go dancing with them, with me? Uh, okay, maybe. Correcto. So, all time. Correcto. Hoy va, well, vuelvan a empezar. Volvemos a empezar, va. Va, vale, empecemos. Okay, teacher. Okay. <laughs> would you like to go? What series on Netflix? Why me tonight? Sorry, I am busy. Uh, I am busy with me with me tonight. I have to I have to to do homework. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time. Okay. Uh, would you like to go for a swing tomorrow morning? Sorry, I am busy. Uh, tomorrow morning, I have to start. I have to go to new. I have to go to university. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time. Okay, would you like to go for pizza next Thursday? Sorry, I am busy. I am busy uh, on Thursday. I have I have had to work that day. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time. Would you like to go for an high screen? Is this afternoon? Would you like to go to go for to go for an ice cream? For, to go for an ice cream? Go for an ice cream this afternoon. Okay, thank you, teacher. Sorry, no. I am busy. Uh, I am busy. This, this. Uh, Luis. Tell me, would you like to walk next Saturday afternoon? Uh, repeat, please. Would you like go for a walk next Saturday afternoon? Ah, okay. Uh, sorry, I busy on Saturday afternoon. I have to go shopping with my mom. Mm -hmm. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time. Would you like to go for a walk? To go, to go, to go. go. To, you know, let me say like here, that's two. Would you like to go? Okay. Uh, Javier, yes. would you like to go for a boat ride next Sunday morning? Sorry, I busy on Sunday morning. I have to go to church. Okay, maybe some other time. Sure, some other time. Manuel, would you like to play basketball with me tomorrow afternoon? Sorry, I busy. On the I busy tomorrow afternoon. I have to work. Okay, maybe. Some other time? Sure, some other time. Okay, next. Excellent. Good job. Clap your hand. Congratulations. Uh, next. Can, can I talk again?
Okay, we're going to practice offering. We're going to say, would you like some ice cream? Yes, please, or no thanks. Would you like a sandwich? Okay, yes. Would you like something to drink? So here you have yes, no, no, yes, yes, for you to choose the answer, okay? So would you like a sandwich? Yes, please. Would you like some cookies? Yes, please. Would you like a beer? No, thanks. Would you like a piece of pizza? No, thanks. Would you like some coffee? Yes, please. Would you like some soda? No, thanks. Right? No, thanks. Okay? So practice offering, offering food. Would you like a piece of cake? Yes, please. Okay. Jessica desapareció. Okay, let's join. Mirna, would you like a sandwich? Yes, please. Um, Luis Alberto, would you like us? No, would you like something to drink? No, thanks. Um, Isaías, would you like some soda? Yes, please, some soda. Um, Jose Eduardo, would you, would you like some coffee? Yes, please. Um, Mirna, would you like some milk? Would you like is some water? No sé okay. quién puede contestar. Quién va a contestar. Yes, please. Mm -hmm. Voy por el otro. Would you like some milk? No, thank you. No. <laughs> okay. Would you like some cookies? Yes, please. <clears throat> cookies, 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 cookies. Would you like some pupusas? Yes, please. Okay. Eh, no sé si falta alguien más. Eh, si quiere, eh, Ricardo, pregunte cinco usted o nos pregunta todos una. Would cada... you like, um, bueno, bueno, nos vamos a desde las seis entonces. Would you like some milk? <coughs> Karen. No, thanks. Um, would you like a beer? No, eh? Yes, please, this. 
Yes, please. Quanta. Would you like some wear weather? Iliana. Yes, thanks. Yes, please. Would you like some cookies? Eh, Jose. Yes, so, well. please. Eh, Karen, would you like some pupusas? Yes, please. No, eh, when you like a pieces of pizza? No, thank you. Iliana, we oh, do like gold. some. Gold. Eh. Gold, gold, gold. Gold, you like. Would you like? Gold. 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 No, sí, sí, me atacaron dos. <risa> Lo siento. <risa> sí. Next. Ok, yo pregunto. Dale, pues. Ok. Will you like a sandwich? Yes, please. Will you like something to drink? Something no, to thanks. drink. No, thanks. Okay, would you like some soda? Yes, please. <laughs> would you like some coffee? Ay, Ricardo, nervioso, conteste. Yes, please, ya no quiere contestar. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like a piece of cake? Yes, please. Would you like some milk? No, thanks. Would you like Okay, we're going to practice the last exercise. Good morning, is Maria home? I'd like to go to the park with her. Sure, let me call her for you. Thanks. Good morning, is Maria home? I'd like to ask her a question. Sure, let me call her for you. Thanks. Good morning, is Maria home? I'd like to invite her to the movies. Sure. Let me call, call her for you, thanks. Good morning, is Maria home? I'd like to chat with her. Uh, sure, let me call her for you, thanks. So go to the park with her, ask her a question, talk with her, ask her out, invite her to the movies, have an ice cream with her, chat with her, go shopping with her, study the lesson with her, go out with her, okay? So practice this the last time. Good morning. Is Maria home? I creo que la tiene que terminar. I like to go. 
I'd like to go to the park with her. I'd, I'd like I'd like to go to the park. I'd, I'd, like, I'd like to go to the to the park with her. Sure. Let me call her for you. Sure. 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 Let me call her for you. Sure. Let me call her for you. Thanks. Good morning. Is Maria home? I like to ask her a question. Questions. Sure, let me call for uh, sure, let me call her to Los otros no han venido. Teacher, nos dejaron solo. Los otros dos compañeros no ingresaron. Okay. T-shirt, other company. Pero me quita cosa. Puede compartir. Sí, ahorita estoy buscando. Sixteen. Bueno, para llegar hasta el último, desde el celular me cuesta. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let's go to attend. Camilo Ernesto Guzmán. Present, Mr. Excellent, nice. Cecilia del Carmen Hernández. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Fátima Lisset Llanes. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Gerardo Alfredo Chicas. Present teacher. Excellent. Iliana Estela Serrano. Present. Excellent. Nice. Isaías Santana González. Present. Excellent. Nice. Javier Antonio Reyes. Present. Very good. Nice. Jessica Maricela Zabaleta. Disappeared. Okay. Jose Eduardo Valdez. Presente. Nice, very good. Jose Osmar Campos. Present teacher. Very good, nice. Karen Leticia León. Present teacher. Yes, very good. Carla Esterlina Guerra. Present. Excellent, nice. Luis Alberto Cruz. Present. Nice. Luis Enrique Castaneda. Present, teacher. Excellent, nice. Manuel Antonio Romero. I'm here, teacher. Excellent, nice. Irna Janet Saldaña. Present. Excellent, very good. Noé Antonio Barrera. Ya me cambió el nombre, oh. Antonio. Hoy, oh, perdón, Noé Humberto. Es la hora, I'm, Nora, el teacher está I'm cansado. Here, Mr. Ah, ya, ya estoy más en la cama que, que aquí. Ok, so... Esaú Cartagena Ann Martín eh, Ricardo Martínez Present Excellent, very good Ok um, 
hoy se queda conmigo Noé Humberto Barrera. Okay. The others, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. See you tomorrow. Good night. Uh, good evening, Noe. How can good I? Evening. Perdón. ¿En qué le puedo ayudar? Vaya, sí. Fíjese de que por lo menos una de las dudas que tengo es el uso de tú. Este, cómo definir bien en qué momentos utilizarlos, porque ese tiene. No sé si yo lo he entendido mal, porque como que tiene un significado como auxiliar, pero también tiene una, un uso como palabra, ¿verdad? No le, no le entendí a qué se refería. Vaya, el, el, me confundo con el uso de la, de la palabra tú. Ah, Por la, ejemplo, allí donde dice... La preposición oh. tú. Ajá, preposición, cabal. La preposición tú. Ajá, este, ¿cuándo utilizarla? Porque es eso, ¿verdad? Que se dice preposición, pero en algunos, en algunas ocasiones como que fuera auxiliar, ¿o no? Par, no, es parte del verbo. Eh, auxiliares solo es do, does, is, are, or would, could, might, todas esas son auxiliares. Tú solo es una preposición. A veces la preposición aparece en, eh, antes de un verbo para hacer el infinitivo, to go, to study, ¿verdad? Y eso se usa ahí en esa historia. Ok. Let's see. Usamos to para hacer infinitivo con I like okay. I want I need I plan I have Okay, so you say to study. I'd like to study. I want to study. I need to study. I plan to study. I have to study. Con estos, en frente de esto, usa to study. Ajá, yo, yo estaba viendo ahí medio, me, me metí en internet como para averiguar. Y es similar, pero quiero quedar bien claro, ¿verdad? Porque como a veces uno solo leyendo no logra entender, no es como que alguien le explique, ¿verdad? Ajá. Este, lo logré entender, eh, como ese ejemplo que usted me pone, como que cuando, como bueno, para separar los verbos, digamos. Cuando aparezcan estos verbos, usted pone este. Este es un infinitivo. Ajá. Está diciendo aquí es estudiar. O sea, digamos, un verbo en infinitivo... Eso sería equivalente a lo que es, vemos en español. Ar, er, ir. Bailar, comer, dormir. Right? Ar, er, ir. No, no es como... Bah, porque yo allí le había entendido que siempre después de un verbo, si voy a utilizar otro verbo, tiene que llevar tú en medio. No. Hay verbos específicos, pero le puse esta listita aquí. Con estos sí va a usar infinitivo. Hay otro que puede usar infinitivo o, o gerundio. Y ese lo vamos a estudiar. Quiero ver. En el curso. No sé si es el otro curso. En el 3. Va, ok. Entonces, otra de las dudas que tengo. Este, por ejemplo, allí donde tenemos I have. Si yo quisiera decir, por ejemplo, no tengo. Sería I, I don't, don't. I don't have, pero yo en algunas lecturas he visto 
que dice, por ejemplo, I haven't, como que estuviera el not eh, contractado en el verbo. No sé si es posible. Sí, es posible, solo que no en este caso. Porque have también es un auxiliar para el presente perfecto. Por ejemplo, no he comido. No de no ever, pero si no, no he comido. ¿okay? I haven't eaten. Y eso lo van a estudiar también más adelante. Presente perfecto. I haven't eaten. She hasn't seen. Y usted lo ha visto contractado porque dice, Have you eaten yet? ¿Ya comiste? Have you eaten yet? Yes, I have. Or no, I haven't. Uh -huh. Pero eso oh, lo, okay. lo van a ver más adelante. De momento todavía. Todavía, todavía. no. Todavía no. Sí, todavía no. Vaya, sí, la otra tenía otras dos dudas que, bueno, ahora fue lo que le consultó Luis, que era ese, que también aquí está un ejemplo de eso, el, la contracción de la D y la del otro, que es solo este, eh, LL. Si, decí, eh, si decimos, vale. I es I would. Si decimos I'll, es I will. I would and I will. Esas serían las contracciones. I'd, I would. I'll, I will. Uh -huh. Vaya, ok. Y creo que ya para, como para finalizar... Va de lo que hemos estado viendo, ¿verdad? De lo, que el presente continuo, cosas así. Eh, con las explicaciones que ha estado dando ya me quedó claro. Solo que en lo que... No sé si yo no he puesto mucha atención. Eh, por ejemplo, cuando hablamos de presente participio, ¿a qué nos, re nos referimos? Presente participio es el verbo ING. Es el que acompaña a IS para hacer el... el progresivo. Is eating. Is eating. El eating está en presente participio. Es el que decimos endo, ando. Estoy comiendo, estoy durmiendo, estoy pensando. Ese... O sea, es que cuando hablamos del participio es lo mismo que el presente progresivo, por así decirlo. El presente pues... progresivo está compuesto por el verbo to be y el, el participio. Ah, okay. el participio activo, el participio activo que sería ando, endo, yendo, y el participo, participio pasivo que sería item, gone, studied. Ah, cuando, cuando hablamos de ese, así como, como ese ejemplo, para el presente continuo siempre vamos a utilizar to be, porque que lo estamos haciendo en el momento. Sí. She Ajá. is working, he is studying. Ajá. Va, ok, entonces sí. Bueno, prácticamente eso, eh, la, la que más siento que me, que me cuesta es esto que, que le consultaba aquí, ¿verdad? El tú, de okay. que siento que me, que me cuesta. Por ejemplo, si yo quiero armar una oración, o sea, sí, ahí es, me cuesta bastante dónde colocarlo. ¿verdad? Tiene que fijar en cuestiones así como la del ejemplo. Ajá. Para cuando quiera sí. usarlo. Ajá. Ah, pues entonces, de momento eso sería todo. Okay. De acuerdo, entonces lo dejo para que vaya a hacer la tarea. Okay. Va. Está bien ahí. Muchas sí. gracias. Este, ya hay que ir haciendo el final también. Pero bueno, Ajá. todavía es el miércoles el final. Ajá. Ahorita este, creo que voy al día, Iba, porque. Sí. Ajá. Pero. Ahí estamos entonces. Pues. Good night, teacher. Good night, my friend. Take care. Oh, gracias. Sure. Pues.